I'm Robert Field with the Orange County Register and welcome to OCN2 for Thursday, March 12th. The founder of a $100 million mixed martial arts clothing company called Tap Out died early Wednesday when his Ferrari collided with a Porsche before crashing into a curb and cement pole in Newport Beach. Newport Beach police say 45-year-old Charles Mask Lewis was pronounced dead at the scene and a woman in the car with him was ejected. Her condition was not released. Lewis was a former Marine and had worked for the San Bernardino Sheriff's Department. He lived in Huntington Beach. The driver of the other car, 51-year-old Jeffrey Kirby of Costa Mesa, was arrested on suspicion of gross vehicular manslaughter while intoxicated. Police were still investigating the cause of the crash late Wednesday night. Orange County school districts this week have targeted more than 2,500 employees for job cuts as they seek to carve roughly $245 million from spending before Sunday's state layoff notification deadline. About 1,200 of the employees identified for possible layoffs so far are certified, a job category dominated by classroom teachers. The figures represent 19 of 29 districts, making it likely the total number of possible job losses may still rise by hundreds, and the amount slashed may eventually exceed $260 million. A certified public accountant has been arrested on charges of stealing $577,000 from her employer by forging her employer's signature and writing checks to herself. Prosecutors say 39-year-old Susan Rochelle of Fullerton is charged with 107 felony counts of forgery, one count for each forged check. Rochelle, whose job was maintaining company finances at Consolidated Design West, is being held on $600,000 bail and is scheduled for arraignment today. Tonight, two Orange County residents will compete on the TV game show Jeopardy! in a tournament of champions. Cora Peck of Aliso Viejo, who teaches social studies at Irvine High School, dominated the game and racked up over $100,000 over five nights of competition last year. Tom Morris, a substitute teacher who lives in Irvine, also took home more than $100,000 last year with his ability to buzz quickly and stay cool under pressure. Both Orange County residents are vying for a $250,000 grand prize. The Jeopardy! Tournament of Champions airs tonight through March 24th. And tonight may be your last chance to see the Grunion Run this season. One of the prime spots to watch them in Orange County is Doheny State Beach. Biologists think it's because the beach is flat. The Grunion Run during high tide to get their eggs far enough on the beach so they aren't washed away. When the next tide comes along and during the next run, they hatch and the fish go into the ocean. Female Grunion can lay up to 3,600 eggs in one spot. And you can read more about all of these stories and get your breaking news all day at OCRegister.com.